Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel. We're getting right into your February 2021 love reading. We have children, your love life is being affected by children. Keep an open mind, your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. And then we have give your relationship a chance, work on this partnership. So someone wants to work hard on giving you this 10 of cups, you know, um, Long-term marriage here, um, a successful relationship, not only emotionally, but physically here. Because we do have your energy as the king of wands. You could be in your more masculine energy while this person is trying to figure out their feminine energies, which is why the Ten of Cups is here. You could have children. They could have children from someone else. And it's like they, they want to work on this. They want to give this relationship a chance. But um, they're learning how to co-parent on top of raising kids and being with you. And for some of them, it's like... You're, you're trying to work on this because of children and you know that your soulmate is different from your usual type. We have very soon. Clearly, clearly decide what you want so that it <clears throat> comes to you right now, Sagittarius. So definitely know what you want because I do see indecision here. We have the Knight of Cups in reverse. So this is not being on the same page for the month of February. Um, we need balance here. It could be arguments about not opening up emotionally here. And this person is definitely listening to you. We have the Six of Pentacles in reverse with the Devil. Could be dealing with the Capricorn, but I believe Sagittarius, you've been thinking about this for a long time. But it was so hard for you to open up. Like, like you felt overwhelmed. Like you were asking too much. If you ask this person to be more affectionate or just open up emotionally, and it's like now you both are kind of at a stack still. But I feel like you're gonna speak up on this, and this person's gonna figure out how to take action. But if you see the Eight of Swords and the Five of Wands here, they're stuck. Like, they hear what you're saying, but then we have, they're really caught up in their heads on how to figure this out. They're in hermit mode with the Virgo energy here. Could be, could be dealing with the Virgo, trying to figure it out. So, if you're getting distance from this person, then this is why. Sorry, I just hit the camera. But we have the Leo energy here with the Emperor. Like, this is your divine masculine. Like, they hear what you say, and they definitely are going to work on this. We do have, um, I think it's just the Leo energy <laughs> But they are definitely showing up. Also Aries. Yeah, we have Six of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Six of Pentacles in reverse. The Five of Wands in reverse. And the High Priestess. Yeah. So for some of you, you kind of ignore your intuition. And it's like, now it's like you want to speak up. And you're kind of figuring out how, Sagittarius. I feel like you should for the month of February. You know, Ten of Wands energy. Get this off your chest or it's going to keep being a heavy burden on you. You know, you're going to be in this devil energy um, just with obsessive thoughts on this. So definitely speak what's on your mind, Sagittarius, because they are going to hear you. Yeah, even if this person is cold, Gemini energy, Libra, or Aquarius is saying to still speak up on what you want because they are going to listen. Yeah, because I don't want to let you go with the world in reverse and the hangman in reverse. I feel like you guys have a lot of past history. Why is the four of cups showing up? Yeah, Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, it's like you're frustrated because you're putting in your half of the work. And, you know, you've been through relationships like this before where things just wasn't working out. But I feel like this person really does love you because we do have this Ace of Cups. They they just don't know how to express it. And it could just be hurt from their past. Because you see this Four of Cups with the Ace of Cups. They want to give you this. They want to give you an opportunity. <clears throat> and they are listening. It's like they're overwhelmed with the Seven of Cups. Yeah. Nine of Stars energy, the Nine of Cups. Yeah, there's a completion going on with the number nines that are popping up. Yeah, this person's going to realize how much you made them happy, and they're going to come in and look at this. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat. This person <clears throat> is struggling to figure out what they want to say, but if you see this imagery here, this Four of Cups is in reverse. They're coming in. They took this cup, pouring it out, and giving you a brand new love offer, Sagittarius. I mean, beautiful energy with the Ace of Cups and Ace of Wands. And it's going to be a spiritual awakening, spiritual union here. Because we do have that Emperor energy and the King of Wands with this Ten of Cups. I mean, this is a long time. Like I said, reconciliation at its finest. King of Wands energy showing up again. They are listening to you. Because of what happened in the past, they definitely learned from this. They put in the work and now they're going to communicate and fight back. Look at that. 
clarify this king of wands this person is very very attracted to you yeah and they know if they come in this manner you might pull your emotions back with this queen of cups because you're still healing so they know that they can't just come at you in a passionate intimate way you know they're this could be also why they're holding back right now because they know you're this happiness and they want to like make love to you and it's like i don't know that's what i'm getting for some of you with this ace of wands and the sun um yeah but they want a second chance they hear you i feel like they're planning yeah they're planning to come forward six of stars energy because they know you're gonna leave why is the five of wands here this could be their energy yeah with the moon Water, full moon and leo along with mercury retrograde so i have unions coming back for a lot of signs for february and it's not because of valentine's day it's because of mercury retrograde and all this shit that's happening the will is turning this your divine masculine is coming sagittarius <laughs> We have union. This is divine fate with the moon and the four of wands. Someone's coming in and tell you something. What is it? I need to go my own way for a while. We have you are irreplaceable. Because what's happening is with this hermit energy and the moon, a lot of things are coming out that this person still needs to heal from with the moon card. So for some, it is going to take a while because they're, they're just learning this in the month of February. You know, you're going through an awakening here so you know this is a collective reading take a high resonate for some you are going to hear from this person for others you know it's still going to take some time because we do have that eight of swords and the five of swords you know at the end of this reading so you know patience we have the thought of you so it does things to me exactly which is why they're holding back right now because i'm telling you that heat is real but it's saying to decide on what you want because what's happening is this person is stuck. If you're stuck, they're going to keep being stuck, Sagittarius, right? This Queen of Pentacles energy, your Queen of Cups energy. If you're so indecisive, they're going to keep being indecisive here. See? Because you're still trying to figure out what you want and it's going to keep them stuck if you see that imagery there. All right? Sagittarius, I'm going to leave it there. Take care. Let me know if this resonated.